Hey you guys, Game.Film here, back with another video. This is the channel where we have fun, but stay informed. No video game talk or film talk today. I just want to talk a little politics. Um, Kamala Harris has been on the campaign trail, and she debated Trump recently. And I've seen a lot of y'all fall back in line saying you're going to vote for her. Got to be Trump. Got to vote blue. Got to vote Democrat. But guys, we're approaching about a year into an actual genocide. Israel is committing... A Holocaust in real time with the help of the US and the West greenlit by Biden Harris and the Democrats and Harris on the campaign trail says she's gonna keep her foot on the gas um, Israel has a right to defend themselves, right? So it's like I'm my question to you guys Voting for her, it's like are you guys all right? Like have y'all not seen what's been going on? Israel is wiping out an entire race Okay and it doesn't matter who's in office. Uh, the goal on this channel is to kind of prove to y'all the Democrats and Republicans are the same party, right? So it doesn't matter if Trump is in office, a Democrat or Republican. They'd be green lighting this too, okay? I'm not a Trumper or anything. Some people don't understand that just because I shit on Democrats. But it's like, guys, I've seen photos, a uh, video of carpet bombing, uh, men, women, and children, babies, limbs blown off. I've seen decapitations, I've seen just faces melted off. Um, the most horrendous stuff um, I've ever seen. And just, there's a famine going on too, it's just not carpet bombing. Um, to sickly, thin um, babies, children, men and women. So, I don't understand what, what y'all's thought process on this with voting again. You guys said that we gotta defeat fascism, we gotta defeat Trump. like. We gotta get a, a centrist in there, not, we can't put Bernie or, we just got to get somebody that can defeat Trump. You guys had your chance, this is what you got. You voted for this, so it's like, you can't get any worse than a freaking genocide, man. Like, what is going on in y'all's heads? I really would like to know. Um, I've got videos proving how October 7th was um, a lie, Israel knew it was gonna happen, their goal was to wipe out Palestinians and Arabs, take the land and resources, and I don't know, man. Like I've got friends and family. Like I've been telling them all this, and like, oh, oh shit, okay, I kind of, I kind of get it now, okay. But then it's like they woke up and for, for, forgot everything. Um, it's just really depressing. I don't understand, guys. So I'm just trying to remind y'all what's going on. Um, a vote for Kamala uh, or Trump is just a vote for genocide. There's no, um, there's no excuse, guys. I mean, Kamala is, is pro cop. She's one of the most pro cop candidates in history. Biden's probably tied with her, and I told y'all that too, man. And it's like she doesn't care about police brutality now that it's Trump. So it's like y'all with your Black Lives Matter and your bios, you can't. That's my rule. You can't say Black Lives Matter if you're going to vote for Kamala. Like, I, I, I don't know where to go off more than that. But it's like, um, think about Palestine, guys. And if you're voting this two-party system, I'd really like to know uh, why in the comments. So that's my rant for today, guys. I'm just so sick and tired.